Young Turks, new sponsor, Squarespace. Go. Squarespace. Wait, is that a square? Let's start with uh, a growing trend in Republican politics, which is crime. Uh, apparently, this is uh, Glenn Beck disease, and it's caught on. Uh, but, you know, they think, well, it worked for Glenn Beck. I guess let's cry. I mean, John Boehner goes out there. We're showing you the clip. <laughs> My God, I'm so emotional. I'm living the American dream. I get tax cuts more for the rich. Yes. And, uh, and the media is, you know, uh, overwhelmed by it. They're very happy about it. And so since it's worked for him, here comes Mitch McConnell. Now, by the way, this is not the first time. This is his third time in recent months. Uh, crying uh, about colleagues leaving. Uh, last time he was crying, he was crying about his chief of staff leaving to become a lobbyist. To give you a sense of how much they're uh, crying these days, it's like, oh my God, the lobbyists are so awesome. <laughs> and this time it's about Judd Gregg. Uh, so let's watch. Now to say that I've had to convince Judd to stay is an understatement. Oh, uh, don't do it, man. Don't do it, man. But he knew it was his time to move on and to write the next uh, chapter, <clears throat> next chapter in his life. <laughs> and while senators come and go all the time, I can't help but note that when Judd walks out of this chamber, <clears throat> when he walks out of this chamber for the last time, He'll leave an enormous void behind. <clears throat> and so I'll close, oh, oh God, so old friend and colleague, by saying that you're certainly going to be missed. <laughs> Remember when we used to sell out to Wall Street together? I'd say, hey, you take the check from J.P. Morgan, and I'll take the check from Goldman Sachs. <laughs> <laughs> And remember, we, I'd say, all right, you take the oil money, and I'll take the tobacco money. And now you'll be sorely missed. Who else can I sell out to lobbyists with? Oh, right, all the other Republicans. And most of the Democrats. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. And this ain't something. Come on. Like, they have this inflated view of themselves. Like, oh, my God, will the Senate chamber ever be the same after Judd Gregg leaves? Yes. Totally the same. Uh, they're just going to bring in a guy who's going to do the same exact thing, which is take lobbyist checks and represent the lobbyists instead of us. Almost nothing will change. <laughs> All right, so of course that leads to the question. J.R. Jackson, is it real or is it fake? Have they, uh, do they feel like, oh my God, this Glenn Beck thing's working, let's get on a roll here, or, or, uh, or is it real? Like, oh my God, they've just torn up about this old friend of theirs. It's these. real and pathetic. I, I, you know, there's... This, what do you get from doing this? Like, mm -hmm. you get some, you know, more votes. You get some campaign dollars from crying over them leaving. He's actually, I think, torn up about it, and it makes no sense. It's mm -hmm. pathetic. It's weak. How, now, I, I, yeah. how are people going to respect and fear America with these crying little babies? Now, you see, what JR is doing is exactly what the Republicans would have done if it was all Democrats crying. Uh, how do we know if they've done it in the past when Dick Durbin cried? Uh, you know, they're like, oh, Dick Turpin, what a wuss. <laughs> yeah. yeah, how are you going to represent America this way, right? When uh, Republicans cry, oh, they're so in touch with their emotions. I mean, they will, you know, burden the middle class in favor of the rich, but they're so wonderfully emotional. Can't you, you know, relate to Mitch McConnell and John Boehner because they cry all the time? <laughs> First of all, no, I cannot. <laughs> Second of all, uh, I, here comes the double standard again, as JR is pointing out. If Democrats do it, remember Muskie did it now, that was a long time ago, uh, but he was running for president, and everybody's like, oh, that's it, he's eliminated. Weak Democrat, shed a tear, that's it, you're done, Pfft, gone. Now Republicans are doing it over and over, and they're like, they're wonderful, wonderful human beings. In fact, it shows their humanity. Here's what I have to say about that. All right. I think I'm clear enough. We're going to move on. New sponsor at the Young Turks, Squarespace. They help you build websites. They've got 24-7 support, and they've built some of the largest 
websites in the world. They have an iPhone app, so you can edit your website on the go. TYT promo code, 10% off for the life of your order. Squarespace.